leaking power's guilty secrets. It's not a phrase, it is a sentence. And no one is facing a longer sentence than Julian Assange for doing that precisely. We have a duty. We have a duty to stop them from destroying Julian's body. We have a duty not to let them continue his torture. Comrades, first they came for Julian. Next, they will come for our comrades, our friends, our neighbors. They will go after anyone who dares challenge the right of power of the oligarchy without frontiers to commit crimes against humanity in our name without our knowledge. The journalists who are failing so spectacularly to defend Julian today. You are next. You are on a hit list with a ranking order. The hit list of President Trump who considers all of the press to be the enemy of the people. When you turn a blind eye to Julian's torture, you are consenting to your own emasculation. That is our message to the BBC. That is our message to The Guardian. Freedom's worst enemy is apathy. It is fatigue. It is good people, too tired, too exhausted, too disheartened, working zero-hour contracts, whatever, to be able to expend the energy that you and I have the privilege of expending today. I blew the whistle on the European Finance Minister's cabal who were plotting behind closed doors, turning against the interests of their people, not just the Greek people, but the German people, the French people, everyone, behind closed doors. On the 10th of March, in a few days' time, one of the projects that Julian and I started is going to see the light of day. Watch out for Euroleaks. in Belmarsh, visiting together with John Shifton, Julian's magnificent father, Julian. And I'm going to relate to him your spirit, the spirit of everyone from every European country and beyond. Because you may be out of the EU, but you are firmly embedded in Europe's progressive movement. So stiffen your upper lip. We are in the business of allowing unalloyed, unarmed truth to have the final word. Because we are in the business of creating the circumstances so that Julian's sentence will end neither with a bang nor with a whimper, but with a magnificent full stop. Thank you. <laughs>